What's up, you guys? This is Mary with High Priestess Intuition. This is a, a wolf card reading for Sada Pisces for October of 2022. This can resonate if you have Pisces in any aspect of your charts. Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, North, No, Moon, Haven, Jupiter charts. Don't forget the basics. Time is fluid. Energy is fluid. If it doesn't apply, it apply. Everyone has free will. Only take the messages that resonate with the rest. Free general collective reading for Sada Pisces. I encourage everybody to check out the Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, or the Midhaven and Jupiter charts for additional message or messages if they apply for you. And this is a free general collective reading. This is not a personal. Um, just to let everybody know, okay? Thanks, everybody, for all the new subscribers. I appreciate all the love and support to the channel. I really do. Good Lord, how long did that take me? Oh my God, it took forever. Maybe one of you guys is waiting patiently for something. Because I mean, that took me forever. Usually I could swoop them up. Maybe one of you guys is waiting patiently for something, possibly. For a package, news, or something. Something, I feel. You plug it in, how it resonates. I did receive two channel messages as I was meditating on your energy for October of 2022 for Sound of Pisces. The first one I heard about to learn... Uh, about to learn of news of an eviction was the first one. About to learn news of an eviction. So energies can be reversed. So, you know, if it's not you about to get evicted, it could be somebody you're connected to. Only you know your situation and story, not anybody else. About to learn news of an eviction. So you plug that in, how it resonates, Pisces. That was the first one. The second one I heard, um, surprise, shocking communication soon. I heard it's going to um, shock the hell out of you. So, whoever that is for, I feel that's for a Pisces. Um, one of you guys is about to get surprised, shocking communication. It, I don't think you thought you would. To me, I feel this could be from anybody. I heard it's going to shock the hell out of you. So, whoever this is that's about to shockingly communicate with you. Um, spirit messages you have a Pisces. Whoever this is, I don't think you expected it. Um, and it sounds like they're about to reach out and communicate with you. Now, to me, I feel that can go positively or negatively. So you have to plug it into your own particular life and situation, however it resonates, Pisces, okay? Some kind of shocking, surprise communication. Spirit messages you have a sign of Pisces. Uh, we have Stingray, Unicorn, and Firefly. Usually I only pull two of these, but I did get three, so um, I'll keep them. For some, you could be dealing with a fire sign, uh, another water sign, or an earth sign. If you are, they could have Aries, Leo, Sag, um, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, or um, uh, Taurus, Capricorn, Virgo, in their Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, Wolf, Sun, Moon, Hammer, Jupiter charts, if you are. Maybe for some, the sh surprise, shocking communication is going to come from a Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, Taurus, Capricorn, Virgo, or Aries, Leo, Sag, possibly. You plug it in, how it resonates. Or maybe one of these signs is going, maybe they're going to get surprise evicted. Um, some kind of shocking eviction. So you plug it in, how it resonates. Here I'm you have a uh, sign of Pisces. Someone lied in a court situation to keep assets. It's about to backfire on them in a huge way. For one, you're a lawyer. Someone lied in court to protect, um, to keep assets. But I heard it's about to backfire on them in a huge way. For one, you are a lawyer. So you plug it in, how it resonates. So for one of you guys, you're a lawyer. And maybe you're dealing with the person that lied in the court of law to keep assets. Or you're on the other side of it, protecting the other person that, um, uh, they lied and put a law strictly to uh, keep assets. You plug it in, how it resonates, but whoever lied and put a law to keep assets, strictly to keep assets, I heard it's about to backfire on them. So you plug it in, how it resonates, only you know which side of the karmic wheel you're on there, Pisces, but for one, you are a lawyer, I'll tell you that. And for one, you'd be dealing with Scorpio or dealing with Scorpio Scorpion energy because of the transformation energy. Number eight could be a very significant number in one's life. Number eight could be a possible age of you or somebody you're connected to or any other significant number. Number eight.
I think this is a shocking communication coming for some of you guys um, from someone you would have never expected is what I'm feeling um, for some of you guys. Because, you know, Stingray shock. For anybody who doesn't know, um, I've been stung by Stingray before in the ocean. They sting like hell. And it's definitely a shock. So just saying. Information is about to come out on an air sign and prostitution. It is about to shock the hell out of you. Shock the hell out of you. For one, information is about to come out on a Pisces and prostitution. You're low vibrational. It's about to shock the hell out of you. You were protected in this community for a very long time. A very long time, but it's about to come out. Oh, Lord. Oh. Okay, so you plug in how it resonates. So we have a low vibrational air sign prostitute and a low vi or pimp. I heard prostitution, so I feel they could be the pimp or the prostitute. Um, you could uh, the and a low vibrational Pisces. So low vibrational Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. I'm presuming femme, and a low vibrational Pisces. I'm presuming femme. Um, I heard these people were protect. Um, uh, I heard prostitution, so I think they're femmes. Um, I didn't hear gigolo. I'm just saying. So, I think they're fans, and I heard they were um, protected in their community for a very long time. So, people utilize their services, and that's why they protected them. But I heard information, shocking information is about to come out about them. So, shock, stingray shock. And I heard um, they are about to be exposed, and they are about to have severe legal issues. Okay, I heard they're about to be exposed, and they're about to have severe legal issues. So I feel for some, you're going to be happy about this with the great happiness energy here. Um, maybe for some, you're going to, you're helping expose this Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, Femme, Prostitute, or Pimp, or Low Vibrational Pisces, Prostitute, or Pimp. You have to plug yourself in where you fit, but it's shocking that I heard the community protected them for a very long time, for a very long time, but it's about to come out. It sounds like the community's tired of it, and they're trans the community is transforming. And they want it out. I heard they're about to have very heavy legal issues. Um, they tried to scapegoat. The air sign tried to scapegoat a family member. But it's about to backfire in a huge way. Okay, I heard the air sign tried to scapegoat a family member. But it's about to backfire in a huge way. So the Gemini Libra Aquarius tried to scapegoat a family member. But it's, but it's uh, about to backfire in a huge way. So it sounds like the Gemini Libra Aquarius is either a pimp or a prostitute. The low vibrational Pisces is either a pimp or a prostitute. For some, you could be happy exposing these low vibrational pimps or prostitutes. But the air sign, the Gemini Libra Aquarius, low vibrational Gemini Libra Aquarius, either pimp or prostitute, they were trying to scapegoat a family member, meaning they were trying to pin it off on their family member as they were a prostitute, but I heard they're not. Um, they most certainly are not. The whole community knows it. Everybody knows it. It's about to backfire. Okay, I heard they're, okay, so their family member most certainly is not a prostitute, and the whole community knows it, everybody knows it, and it's about to backfire. On the air sign, and probably a low vibrational prostitute or pimp, Pisces. You plug it in how it resonates. Holy crap. And that's transformation in the community, in the situation, because I heard the whole community and the, and the whole, and it sounds like society knows this family member that this air sign tried to pin on as a scapegoat saying they're a prostitute. They're not. It's really this low vibrational Pisces and this low vibrational air sign. That's too much, man. All right, we're moving on. Unicorn. A Pisces is about to completely recre recreate themselves.
One, you're going to move far distances and completely reinvent yourself. Okay, so you plug in how it resonates. So one of you guys is about to completely reinvent yourself. I heard you're going to move far distances and reinvent yourself, recreate and reinvent yourself. So I think you're going to take on the unicorn energy, and I think it's going to shock people with the stingray energy. You're going to reinvent yourself, recreate yourself. I think new job field, new job title, new career sector, um, new, new, new. Uh, it could be new uh, aesthetic, outward external aesthetics. Um, just new, new, new everything. But you, you. It sounds like you want to transform and move far distances to recreate yourself if this resonates like it will give you great happiness to do so whoever this is uh you haven't done it yet but it sounds like you're about to so you plug it in how it resonates uh, pisces in this aspect you're taking on the unicorn energy and one very light side piscean Really heavy into spirituality. You're leveling up in the spiritual realm. New gifts, new talents, new skills, new abilities. Well, that's beautiful. And one of you guys, uh, you're very heavy in the spiritual realm. Uh, I mean, you're very heavy in spirituality. I'm sorry. You're very heavy in the spirituality. So you're very spiritual. Now, you can be spiritual and religious or just spiritual. Only you know your situation and story, not anybody else. But you're leveling up in the spiritual realm. I feel for some you could be readers, for some you may not be, but however that resonates, you have the players. I feel you have the players, uh, clear audience, clear voice, uh, clear sentience, dreamscape abilities, and then the smell one, um, one or two or two plus of those. But you're leveling up in the spiritual realm, so I think your gifts are getting stronger or you're developing new uh, gifts. I heard new gifts, skills, talents, and abilities, so that's in the spiritual realm. I feel for some you could be readers, for some you may not be, but you're the unicorn in this energy. In this situation, you were taking on the unicorn energy. Um, I love it. I love the unicorn energy. Y'all know I do. Um, and it's you manifesting yourself in the spiritual realm. You're, and I think it gives you great happiness, or it's going to give you great happiness once you realize your skills, talents, and abilities in the spiritual realm. Pro probably the players are getting stronger or developing. How that resonates and applies, okay? You're transforming. Oh, you're leveling up and it's getting stronger. Fair firefly. A very significant child custody battle through many shocking series of chain events. Children are about to come back with the mother. It's about to shock the hell out of you. You're about to learn about this soon. Everybody is about to learn about this soon. It's about to come very public. Very, very, very public. And shocking information of the past regarding an abuse and exploitation of this family is about to come out. Very public. It's about to shock you. Holy moly almighty. So you, this is juicy. Okay, so you plug in how it resonates. So... There's some kind of child custody battle energy going on right now in the energetic space. It doesn't sound like it's you, Pisces. It sounds like it's somebody you know or somebody you're past or somebody you're connected to. Maybe for some, you're going to help with this to get this, make it turn the wheel like uh, in this favor, possibly. Only you know your situation, sorry, not anybody else. But um, there's a child custody battle currently going on in the universe. Um, and it sounds like two or two plus children are not currently with the mother sounds like they used to be possibly or or it sounds like they used to be or the mother's fighting for them and they never have been how that resonates but how that resonates um um i heard they're about to come back they're about to well they're i heard they're about to come back with the mother so they used to live with the mother is what i'm feeling they used to live with the mother they're about to come back with the mother i heard it's going to shock you so that stingray energy is going to shock you and some kind of information about um Abuse and exploitation of the family in the past is about to come out. So I think of the child, ch two or two or two plus children and the mother is about to come out. And that's going to shock you too. I heard it's going to go very public. Them coming back with the mother and 
the information on the abuse and exploitation is about to come out. So illumination of the information, I heard it's going to go very public. To me, this is public energy and illumination of um, the uh, information um, of them coming back with the mother and the abuse and exploitation of them in the past. I feel for some, this could make you very happy, um, possibly, um, if you want them to come back with the mother. For some, you may not. Only you know which side you're on. I know for one, you're a lawyer in here, so you plug it in how it resonates. Holy moly. A lawyer is about to report another lawyer for abuse soon. It's going to make you very happy. Oh, my Lord. Whoa. I'm pulling in heavy lawyer energy in here. Okay, so a lawyer is about to report another lawyer soon. It's going to make you very happy. So I feel you're a lawyer about to report another lawyer. Um, I'm assuming you're going to report them to the Bar Association whatever state's bar association or country's bar association, what have you, what have you. Her's going to make you very happy. So I think you're a lawyer about to report another lawyer. Um, obviously, I think it's a very serious situation of why you're about to report them. Um, I think it's going to make you very happy if that resonates for you. Illumination of this information, I think an official reporting um, to the bar association is what I'm feeling. Holy moly. That's going to create transformation. A very significant plane crash is about to become very significant in Pisces' life. And a very significant flight. A lot of plane energy. Okay, a very significant flight. So, this would be you taking this flight or somebody you're connected to taking a flight. I'm assuming that one's not going to crash. At least I hope not. Um, somebody's about to take a plane flight. Whether it's you or somebody you're connected to. It's very significant. It sounds like one of you guys is live. For some, it could be, if you're taking the plane flight, it can make you happy. Um, I'm assuming that's the one that's not going to crash. And then there's a plane crash that's going to happen. It's all the upcoming. It hasn't happened yet. Um, and that is going to become very significant one of you guys' life. So maybe you know somebody on this um, that's going to be on this flight. Or you see it on the news or something of that nature. But somehow, a plane flight is about to become significant one of you guys' life. I feel you could be on the plane or somebody you're connected to. I feel that one's going to get safely, uh, up and down safely. And then there's a plane crash that hasn't happened yet. And that is going to become significant one of you guys' life. I feel you could see it on the news or um, you could hear about it through word of mouth or you're going to know somebody on the plane cra uh, on the plane that crashes. How that resonates, okay? Someone is in the current process of trying to apply for a visa to move out of country. They're going to be denied. Know this. There's going to be many, 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 many problems with their paperwork. Many problems. Oh, my God. Whoa. Somebody's trying to apply for a passport. I heard to move out of country. Um, but I heard it's not going to happen. It's not going to happen. Um uh, there's going to be many, many, many problems with their paperwork. Um, this is divinely guided to happen. This is divinely guided to happen. So they're trying hard to move out of country, whoever this person is. I feel for some, you can know this person. That's why you're pulling this energy in and you're reading. I think you know this person. There's a reason they want to, they're trying to do it fast. Okay, I heard they're trying to do it fast. They're trying to move out of country fast for a specific strategic reason. But I heard um, the paperwork's going to get kicked back because the paperwork's going to be something funky with the paperwork, basically. 
and I heard it's not going to happen. It's not going to happen. And, um, <clears throat> but it's divinely guided to happen that way. So they're trying hard to move out of country fast, but it's not going to happen because it's divine intervention. If that resonates and applies, um, they are criminal. They are criminal. They are criminals, what I heard. They're criminals. So they're criminals. So there's going to be something going on, fucking with their paperwork. They're going to try to move out of country quick. It could be a water sign, an earth sign, or a fire sign trying to do this, or any other sign, but it's not gonna, they're criminal and it's not gonna happen. Whoever this person is and how they apply to you, Pisces. Holy moly. The most difficult part of the situation is over. One, you just applied for school. You got in. One, you have a very important exam coming up. Okay. One, you applied for school. I heard you got in. We're in September, though. Maybe you applied for um, fall? Uh, not fall. Uh, spring? I don't know. Because we're in the middle of school right now. When you apply for school and you got in, I feel this could be college or technical school or something of that nature, maybe at Ivy League, uh, but I heard you got in, so maybe you're applying for um, spring semester, possibly, and for one, you're about to take a very important exam coming up, so uh, I think you've been studying, studying, studying for it, or maybe you're cramming for it, um, and for the one of you that just got into the school that you were wanting to get into, I think it's making you very happy. If that resonates and applies for you, okay? You plug it in how it resonates. A Pisces that's... Uh, a, uh, acquired a lot of money in a court situation in the past. Secret 7 situation. Through many series of chain events, you're about to have to pay it all back. To the rightful owner. It's about to shock the hell out of you. Holy moly. A Pis okay. So a Pisces that acquired, I heard, a lot of money in a court situation in the past. I think this is shocking energy. Uh, through the Secret 7 situation of the past. Um, I heard you're about to have to pay it all back to the rightful owner. So whoever you are, the, uh, whatever Pisces that acquired a large amount of money in the past regarding a secret, the Secret 7 situation, just know you're going to have to pay it all back, it sounds like soon, to the rightful owner. Now, whoever the rightful owner is and how that resonates and applies. Okay? Okay. Great happiness. A grandchild is about to become very significant in Pisces' life. A new home. And a new locale. A grandchild, a new home, and a new locale is about to become very significant in a Pisces' life. Well, congratulations to whoever that's for. I think it's going to make you very happy. Uh, I think it's your grandchild or somebody you're connected to's grandchild. A new locale, so a new location. That could be vacation or that could be moving. We have a lot of far distance relocation in here. Um, whoever this is for, that's beautiful. Um, or the new home. So it, I think it's going to make you very happy if this resonates and applies for you. I think the most difficult part of the situation is over. Maybe you're trying to get your credit score up to obtain the home or you're trying to move, get the money up to move. Or maybe you haven't seen the grandchild in a while or what have you, what have you. 
Um, congratulations to whoever this is for. If that resonates for you, it's going to make you very happy. Um, and absolutely. A friend is about to give you a gift soon, and that's about to make you very happy, too. Very thoughtful gift. Very light side individual. Okay, and a friend is about to give you um, a gift soon. I heard it's about to make you very happy. It's very light side individual. So whoever you are, it's a very light side individual, so they have no ill will towards you. They're not hexing and cursing the item or items. They don't want to... Um, Play secret voyeur cameras in your house or do anything crazy to you in a and harm you in a negative fashion. Um, they don't want to exert control and dominance over you uh, with a hidden camera. You know, they um, they truly care for you in a positive way. Um, they're about to give you a gift. It's going to make you very happy. Congratulations to whoever that's for. When Pisces was really trying to get their business off the ground and it's really taking off now. Really taking off. They're about to pay it forward. Okay, one of you guys was really trying to get your business off the ground, but I heard it's taking off, and you're about to pay it forward. So you were trying really hard to get your business off the ground, trying to transform your business, grow your business. I heard it is taking off. It's taking off, and I heard you're about to pay it forward in some shape, form, or fashion. So maybe somebody helped you take it off, uh, helped get it off the ground, or helped, um, or something of that nature or they helped you in some shape form or fashion um or something helped you how that resonates but how that resonates um you're about to pay it forward in some shape form or fashion however you're about to pay it forward regarding your business taking off um, i think someone or something helped you get it off the ground in some shape form or fashion and that's why you're gonna pay it forward i think it makes you happy that the business is taking off that's beautiful you plug it in how it resonates Pisces. Transformation. Another country from you is about to become very significant in your life. Another country from you is about to become very significant in your life. Canada, United States, Australia. Canada, United States, and Australia is what I heard. Another country from you, Pisces. So it's not a country you currently reside in, I feel. It's about to become very significant in your life. So I heard Canada, United States, and Australia. So if this resonates for you, I don't feel you reside in these countries. Um, you have to plug yourself in where you fit. But um, whichever country that you don't reside in, it's about to become very significant. Canada, United States, Australia. So you plug it in how it resonates. Maybe for some you're going to vacation there or you're, or so, somehow uh, the can Canada, United States, or Australia, one of these countries you don't reside in, or, uh, well, you reside in whatever country you reside in, but one of these you don't reside in, I'll tell you that. It's about to become significant in your life. A cat is about to have to be put to sleep. A cat is about to have to be put to sleep is what I just heard. A cat is about to have to be put to sleep. I am so sorry. My condolences for whatever cat is about to have to be put to sleep. I'm, I, I don't know. Um, both of my cats are very happy and healthy and very docile. So I'm not sure. But somebody, it could be your cat about to have to be put to sleep or somebody you're connected to's cat. But somebody's cat is about to have to be put to sleep. In that, uh, in that aspect, transformation is the cat having to be put down. Maybe they're old. Um, maybe they're uh, older and they just, um, it's their time to go. Or they have attacked an uh, individual possibly. Um, or there's some other radical reason to have to put them down. Um, transformation in this aspect is having to put the cat down. You plug it in how it resonates. If that resonates for you, Pisces. I love a virtual Pisces that has been hiding out in a different state for a long time. They are a huge criminal 
and they are professional. That through many series of chain of events, they're about to be caught. They are a nurse. A RN. They are about to be apprehended. It's about to shock the hell out of them. Huge charges in another state. But they are about to be caught. And arrested. And apprehended. It's about to embarrass the hell out of them. Oh my God. Whoa. You, whoa, you plug it in, how it resonates. Oh, my God. Okay, so that's very detailed. So it is an RN, a registered nurse like me. So re, re, Y'all know I'm a registered nurse. I have been since 2013, but I'm here in Alabama. But I, hell, I'm I'm not a criminal on the run. Um, whoever this is, it's an RN Pisces. Low vibrational, obviously. I heard they have many charges in another state. They, um... They intentionally moved to another state for strategic reasons. It's about to catch up with them in a huge negative way. Oh, my God. Okay, I heard they intentionally moved to another state for strategic reasons, but it's about to catch up to them in a huge negative way. So, it's a registered nurse, Pisces. How the hell? I don't I don't know. Uh, because, you know, you, with us, we have to do the fingerprint verification every year. You have to do a background check. I mean... There's protections there, unless they're frauding somebody. I don't, I don't know. I don't fraud people. I, I don't specialize in criminals. So I don't know how the hell they got away with this, but somehow they did. Um, it sounds like a smooth criminal energy. I was picking that up in Leo's reading. Um, but as a registered nurse, they are very skilled at this, but it's about to backfire on them. Oh, they're very skilled, but it's about to backfire on them. So... They knew what they were doing when they moved states. Uh, they have, apparently have two or two plus charges on them in another state. Whatever state they're in, I didn't hear what state they're in currently, but they are registered nurse. And it sounds like they're practicing professionally right now as a registered nurse. So they're making the big bucks and the money as a registered nurse, but they strategically moved states to avoid the charges or whatever the crap was going on in the other state. Um, but I heard it's about to backfire on them. I heard they're about to be caught and apprehended. And it sounds like they're currently practicing in another state as an RN, a registered nurse. Um, but they're about to be caught and apprehended. It's about to shock the hell out of this community. Shock the hell out of them. It's about to shock the hell out of this community. Shock the hell out of them. So they reside in the United States of America. I'll tell you that. They reside in the United States of America, but they strategically move states to avoid charges, two or two plus charges in another state. They are registered nurse. I'm, they have to have a multi-state license or they applied for another licensure in another state. I only know that because I'm a nurse. Um, but they're about to be apprehended. I heard it's about to embarrass the hell out of the community, shock the hell out of the community. Stingray energy. Um, whoa, that, that is huge. Um, I wonder what the charges are. I didn't hear what the charges are. It's a very low vibrational Pisces, but I heard they're very skilled at it. So they knew what they were doing when they strategically moved states to go practice in another state as an RN. I wonder if it has something to do with their licensure or some kind of abuse or something. Oh, my God. So, transformation. It is about to embarrass the hell out of this community. Embarrass them so bad. This person is a high member of this community. They have had them snowed for many years. Oh, my God. I heard it's about to embarrass the hell out of this community, embarrass the hell out of them, whatever community they currently reside in. And it sounds like they're practicing as an RN, as a high statured member of their community, as a registered nurse. But it's about to embarrass the hell out of the community they're currently in because um, um, they're about to get caught. They're about to get caught. Oh, my God. It's about to create transformation in this community. Um, but they are a criminal. But they strategically, I heard they strategically move states it sounds like to apprehend the charges, whatever charges they are. I think it's going to make law enforcement very happy or the feds very happy to apprehend this person. Um, maybe your law enforcement or the feds or whoever is about, or a private investigator or whoever is about to apprehend this person. Um, great happiness. Um, most difficult part of the situation is over. You're about to apprehend this person. I think you've already located them or you're about to locate them. If you're a private eye, a detective, a fed, or the police, um, I don't, I heard it's going to embarrass the hell out of the current community they're in. So I think whoever this is for, I think you're a PI, a detective, uh, um, 
uh, the feds or something of that nature. Um, I don't think your local police is what I'm trying to say. I don't think your local police, and I think you have apprehended this, uh, you've located this person or you're about to locate this person. Whoa, whoa. A psychic investigator is about to get high on her when this occurs. This person never thought they would get caught. Oh my God, I heard a psychic investigator is about to get high on her when this occurs. This RN, criminal Smooth criminal RN never thought they would get caught. Whoa, but it, it sounds like a psychic investigator has helped locate this person or helped apprehend this person or helped with the location of this person. Holy moly, this is, that's juicy. Um, wow, that's, that's good, that's good. So I think you might be detectives or private eye or feds or something of that nature about to apprehend this person. I think you were having trouble with the locale of this person, but it sounds like you've already located them or you're about to. That's going to create transformation in the um, situation and the community is going to be mortified, but um, um, they did not do their research. They did not do their research is what I just heard. Oh, man. So the community did not do their research. So I think there might be something on their background check. Um, they, it sounds like they hired this criminal RN in uh, at wherever they're working in this community, but they didn't do their research. It sounds like on the background check. Someone else is getting a huge wake-up call. Huge. Someone else is getting a huge wake-up call. Huge. Yeah, this is, wow, this is huge, man. Whoa. I heard a psychic investigator is going to get high on her. So maybe one of you guys is a psychic investigator. Maybe you've helped apprehend this person or give the locale of this person or helped in some kind of details locating this person. This is, wow, that's good for you, psychic investigator, if that resonates. Holy crap. A judge is under very heavy investigation, very heavy, and it's not going to go well for this judge. Fire sign, earth sign judge. For one, you're helping investigate this judge. Holy crap, I heard a fire sign and an earth sign judge is under heavy investigation. It's not going to go well for these judges. For one, you're helping investigate the judge. So we have a fire sign, Aries Leo Sag, and a Taurus Capricorn Virgo judge, masculine or feminine. One of you guys is investigating this judge. Um, so you plug it in how it resonates, you guys. Uh, one, you could beat the judge. Well, no, I heard it. We're in Pisces. Um, Aries Leo Sag, Taurus Capricorn Virgo judge. Heavy judge energy. I think it's making you happy um, investigating this person. Or most difficult part of the situation is over as far as maybe the investigation. Um... How will that resonate? I heard it's not going to go well for them. So whoever these judges are and how they resonate in the universe. Holy crap, man. We are deep in here. Okay, we're done. We're done. All right, I love you guys. I hope this helped and namaste.